Playoff push continues for Charleston Southern. Friday's matchup, no doubt the biggest in program history. Brandon Baylor, the newest member of the News 2 Sports Department, has more on the matchup. We have a great opportunity and a great challenge uh, in front of us going to play the number one team in the country here in FCS. Uh, they, uh, they have a great team. They deserve the number one ranking. But uh, we feel confident about where our team is uh, and the preparation that we've had going, you know, this, in the short amount of time that we've been getting ready for them, that we can feel going down there and win the game. Speaking of preparation, it starts with the health of the quarterbacks, which is up in the air with Austin Brown and Cal Copeland still nursing injuries. Bishop England grad Daniel Krogan led both scoring drives against the Citadel and just might get a chance to do it again. The thing with Danny, and I think these guys will tell you, uh, whenever he's been asked to do something, he's always been ready, and everybody's know he's been banged up. But Danny knows what his limitations are. I think our, our team does, but he also knows what his strengths are, and uh, the coaching staff knows what his strengths are. And so we're going to try to put him in those situations because he can do some things that uh, will help us win football games. Now the defense has been nothing short of spectacular, and according to senior linebacker Aaron Brown, they plan to keep it simple. The coaching staff has always instilled in us that uh, control the controllables. We got to control what we can control on the defensive side of the ball, and we trust that the offense can uh, get it done on the offensive side of the ball. For the second time this year, the Buccaneers will face yet another number one team in Jacksonville State Friday night. Head coach Jamie Chadwell and CSU are hoping to capitalize on the opportunity and move forward in the playoffs. We sort of survived some ugly games, and that's part of it being the playoffs. You just got to try to find a way to win. We're uh, playing for a ladder because it's the next step in our journey. we got to take one more step. So can we climb that ladder? Reporting from Charleston Southern, Brandon Baylor, News 2 Sports.